Machiko! Baby, thank God! What is this weird place? I don't know. My memory's a complete blank. Strange. So is mine. This doesn't make any sense. Right this way, please. Welcome to Quindecum. Please have a seat. A pleasure to meet you. My name is Deckham, and I will be your bartender. Yeah, okay. You will most likely find this a strange question, but I'm afraid I do have to ask it. Do you remember anything prior to your arrival here? <sighs> Nothing. Neither of us seems to. Although... Thinking about it, I'm pretty sure we were on our honeymoon. Yeah, you're right. I can actually remember that much, too. Yes, very good. Thank you for indulging me. Anyway, forget that. Tell us about this place. Situation. This is important. Please pay close attention. Number one. I'm afraid I cannot provide you with any information regarding your current location. Number two. Now that you are here, we shall have you play a game. I'm sorry. Play a game? Number three. As to game selection, that will be decided upon by roulette. <laughs> Number four. The stakes of the game are very high, your lives in fact. What the hell are you talking about? And number five, don't worry, this is the final point. Until the game is completed, you cannot leave. Huh? <laughs> I think we've heard enough, thanks, let's go. Uh, yeah. Poor guy, he's obviously nuts. Hmm? That's strange. Nope, this is the bathroom. Damn it! All right, where's the exit? As I have explained, you cannot leave the bar until the game is finished. And if I say we're not playing your damn game? I would sincerely recommend against it. <laughs> what? Those look like... are they... What is this place? Why are there bodies? As I outlined in both points two and four, we would like you to play a game in which the stakes are your lives. I'm afraid I cannot say more than that. He's some kind of psycho. Must be. If I could have you press this button, please, the roulette will begin. And the game will be decided. What do you think? Let's just do what he says for now. Who knows what'll happen if we don't? The guy's clearly unbalanced. Yeah, you're right. of the game are simple. You will take turns throwing the darts in front of you until someone reaches zero points. Alternatively, if you should run out of darts before that happens, whoever scores lower will be named the winner. You've each been given seven darts. Please throw them from behind the line indicated. And the inner triple. A single bull is worth 25 points while a double is worth 50. You'll notice various regions of the body depicted. Those are linked to your respective nervous systems. Wait, what did you say? We're linked to the boards? Yes. Where the dart hits, you will feel a corresponding pain. Impossible! And naturally, the higher the score is, the greater your pain will be. No! There's no way! You're lying! Calm down, honey. Obviously, this guy's full of it. Let's just pretend to go along with it for now, okay? You sure? If things do get ugly, I'll figure something out. I trust you. Very well. The game will now begin.
Linked to the boards, huh? There's just no way they could do that. <gasps> Magico! No, it's impossible. Maybe it's just in my head. All I felt was a little twinge of pain. It doesn't even hurt. Okay. I don't know. It's all right. Just calm down. Here. Why don't I give it a try now? There is a link. How can they be doing this? Did something stick me? Uh, no, there's nothing. Takashi! Just wait over there! Don't think you can fool me, you psycho! I'm a doctor! There's no sign of any surgery! What have you done to us? Nothing in particular. Then how are you making us feel pain? You can stop it. As I told you before, in this game, your lives are at stake. If you want to avoid inflicting pain, then all you have to do is miss the targets. Seriously? You can miss with all six remaining darts. That will bring the game to a swift conclusion. Oh, yeah. I didn't think about that. Except, of course, that will ensure that Machiko will be the victor. I would lose. What is it? What did he say? Can you hear me? Uh, oh, yeah. Apparently, we have to keep playing the game. He did give me a really good tip, though. We can just keep throwing and missing. It'll end quickly that way. We can do that, really? Yeah. Uh, except if we do, well, look at the score. You would lose. Let's not worry about that for now. That's right. It doesn't matter if I lose. As long as I still have Magico. <sighs> Is something wrong? It's your turn to throw. I spaced out. Sorry. To my hand slipped. It's all right, baby. I'm fine. It's not too bad. Oh, my eyes! Oh, my eyes! Oh, no! I'm so sorry! Are you okay? You had to hit the double ring! I didn't do it on purpose! You know that, right? I'm so sorry! Baby, I'm so sorry! I swear I didn't mean to! Please, baby, don't! Or, if you have to, at least try not to hit my belly. It's your child. What? Really? Yes. <laughs> that explains it. You haven't been acting like yourself. Yes. How many weeks are you? About ten now. Why didn't you say something? I was going to. I wanted to surprise you during our trip. I haven't told anybody yet. I wanted you to be the first one to know. I'm so happy, honey. Try to take it easy now, okay? Right. I'll do my best. I can't believe I'm finally going to be a father. Could you? 
It wasn't on purpose. Yeah, right! What if something happens to the baby? <laughs> what? What is it? I can't even look at you. How could I have forgotten that of all things? What are you talking about? Think, Machiko. Think real hard. That was a nice ceremony, huh? Yeah. You have to admit, though, Machi really does play to win. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. Machi? She's Do always been Machiko? that way. Machi sees something she wants and goes after it. You're not kidding. I hear her husband's a doctor. I'm so jealous. A successful husband and a hot boyfriend. <laughs> <laughs> Your friends should be more careful with what they say. I heard every word of their little conversation. About what? Me? It's almost funny, finding out that you're having an affair on the same day as our wedding. What are you saying? What affair? And I still went through with it. I couldn't bring myself to call it off. I just kept trying to pretend I hadn't heard them. No, you're wrong. I've been faithful. I loved you so much, I would have done anything for you. I love you too. Whatever you've heard, it's wrong. Don't you lie to me! I'm not lying! It's the truth! <laughs> Oh, well. It's all over now. <laughs> Tell me, bartender. What would you like to know? Those rules of yours. There's one you haven't told us, right? What are you doing? That one isn't yours. So what if it isn't? You see, when he explained the rules, he never actually specified the targets. Isn't that right? Your assumption is correct. As long as the dart hits a target, points will be scored. The game's predicated on us taken from each other from the beginning. Seven darts were never going to be enough. The dart in your hand is the last to be thrown, meaning whosoever target it hits will be the winner of the game. You still haven't told us what happens to the loser. Nor can I tell you at this time. Please accept my apology. Rules are rules. I taste of defeat and see how she likes it. You're not used to losing, are you? Who's Machi? That's your nickname, isn't it? Hold on. Just think back for a second. Remember me telling you there was a friend coming to our wedding I hadn't seen in years? I... Yeah, Machida Yuki, a friend from school. She really hated her name when we were younger. She said it was too masculine for her. Uh, wait a second, are you saying... That's the reason we gave her the nickname Machi. Uh, she's Machi? I remember hearing she got married several years ago, to a doctor. But she was having a hard time breaking it off with her old boyfriend. No, you're joking! You think I'm making this up, too? <laughs> yeah, you have to admit, though, Machi really does play to win. You're not kidding. I hear her husband's a doctor. No. My god. So that means the baby is mine? I told you I wasn't lying, but you wouldn't believe me. <gasps> I'm sorry. I admit I was wrong. <laughs> Wait, I didn't mean... Get away from me! <laughs> I'll show you! Hold on! Congratulations. You are the winner, Machiko. And with that, the game is officially at an end. If you would both please move over this way. Just a minute! Please! One more throw! Just one! There's no point! What? Stop. There's no point to any of it. What do you mean? Hey, bartender. We're already dead now, aren't we? Huh? Yes. I'm afraid you have both left the land of the living. Following their deaths, people are either sent to heaven or to hell. That air. Only certain pairs are invited to come here, however. You must have died at the same moment to qualify. My apologies. I'm sorry for not having told you earlier.
Are you gonna answer that? Huh? No, I don't feel like talking right now. <sighs> Give me that. I'll answer for you. Jeez, <laughs> what are you doing? Stop it! What's the <laughs> down. How could something like this happen? I just wanted to start a family. That was all. I wanted to be a father. And instead I killed my own child. How could this happen? You're God, aren't you? There must be something you can do. I'm sorry. My role is merely that of arbiter. It's a dream, right? It has to be. Nothing this crazy could be real. Shut up! Just drop the innocent act on child! What? Whose do you think it is exactly? Somebody else's. Please, it has to be! Takashi, please. Why? You know, you're actually right for once. Yeah. I'm in love with somebody else. <laughs> I mean, it's obvious, isn't it? Did you actually think somebody would ever fall in love with you? What are you, a complete idiot? I didn't want anything but your money! Wait, you mean... You were of course I was lying, moron! I mean your child! <laughs> Dirty bitch! I'll teach you! <laughs> what the hell's happening? <laughs> the game ended when the final dart was thrown. Uh, and you think I care about your damn game? Uh, let me out of this! Once more, I am sorry. You see, the ruling has already been made. I just want to hit her once! Please! Just one time! Very sorry. <laughs> well then, it's time we were off. Come with me, please. Thank you for playing. Best of luck on your journey. Not a bad job there, Deckham. Thank you, I did my best. What did you think about it? Hmm. It was pretty awful. You will get used to it. <sighs> so where did each of them end up going, then? I'm guessing Takashi's soul was sent for reincarnation, and Majiko's was sent into the void. Yes. Oh, I see. Um, maybe you can clear something up for me? <laughs> <laughs> 